Hey my dolls, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Just Me Re, and today I'm going to be talking about the Morphe collaboration with Kathleen Lights. Most of you guys kind of know that I'm already like a huge fan of Kathleen. I pretty much bought like her the Ofra, I bought stuff from ColourPop, and now I bought the Kathleen Lights palette with Morphe. So I'm um, really excited to tell you guys my thoughts and opinions on it. So if you guys are ready for that, let's get into the video. P.S. Just in case you guys aren't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, okay? Thanks, bye! So basically this is my first time ever buying any type of palette from Morphe. And so hopefully like, you know, I'm telling you guys some new, 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 the newness, okay? And um, giving you some good information about the palette. Shipping, like let's start with that first. Shipping was so dope because I got it within like three days, okay? So it said that it was going to take, like I bought it exactly on the day that it launched. I think it launched on a Thursday and I got it out actually on a Monday. So when I purchased it, it said it was going to take like seven to ten business days and that, you know, we can still count. So expect your, like basically it was telling me expect your stuff to be there within two weeks. So I was like, dang it, like I hate waiting, I hate it. Um, but yeah, I was really excited for it and it came super fast. Um, like, like I said, three days, like Thursday I paid for it, Friday, Saturday, Sunday went by and then Monday I got it. So it's just like, <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. So I got that and let me tell you guys, it came in a box, like literally like, oop, with all this in it, a whole bunch of bubble wrap on it, like it was, like they made sure that nothing was gonna crack, bump, nothing. Like they did a good job of protecting it. So basically, just like how she said in her video, it the box looks like this, which I really do love. Like this is like oh, so cute. Like this is what I was talking about. Like I wanted her to have like a cute box. Like the last time that I did a review on her product. So this is what I'm talking about, and I love the back of it. it has like this little cute message, and you know her her little cute, her picture, a cute picture of herself. Um, and yeah, so that was like bubble wrapped and inside like the makeup palette itself was bubble wrapped. Like I'm telling you, they did not want anything to happen to this. Um, so I'm not sure if it was just like a, like, I'm not sure if that's how it always arrives. I'm not too sure. Like I said, it's my first time ever purchasing anything from Morphe. Um, so that so far that's what I, I really do like about that. I mean, it could be any makeup palette that's probably how it arrives I'm not sure I might get drugstore products so it doesn't need all that bubble bubble bubble, bubble wrap this eye just so you guys know the eye that I'm I have here um going on yeah I have something on my face I can feel it it's probably here anyways so yeah this makeup is all like using what was in this uh, palette I did do a tutorial on it so if you guys are interested in that it would be up hopefully soon so yeah this is the the colors this is how it looks like like I said I already digged in it I played in it I swatched this bad boy and I I, I love it like first of all I want to say because I am a beginner like at makeup so I look for deals you know and for it to be it was $14.99 I did use her code um, Kathleen lights um, for 10% off and it did bump it down to like 13 like it basically took care of like the, the tax but in total with um, shipping shipping I did pay $22 for it so not that bad like most of the time palettes are like 50 to I don't know $80 maybe like mm, 20 bucks was cool for me and another thing that I do like about this palette is that like you can go from doing a really bold and dramatic eyeshadow look like this to something very simple and everyday wear used as well um, that's one thing I really do like about it like it is a great um, practice you know for beginners like someone like me um, or someone out there who's basically just trying to like get better at doing makeup these shades are big well you know for just like something that's like every day or if you want to go kind of like bold and dramatic um, just depends on on you and how you want to wear your makeup like I said see there's some like I do appreciate the fact that there are some like cold and then warm I won't lie like for me I'm more 
I'm really good with doing like warm eyeshadows. Like I feel like warm eyeshadows usually look the best on me. But this time I kind of wanted to go a little bit like cooler tone and because I was really inspired by this green. I did do a swatch my Instagram just in case you guys don't know. It's just me underscore re with three E's. Um, so this is basically right here, the swatches. And when I tell you, oh my God, like these swatches, literally they they really show up they're so pigmented they're so creamy and so smooth like i mean like they're not chalky whatsoever so that's why i was just like wow like maybe i should continue to buy more morphe like eyeshadows because because of that like drugstore some drugstores sometimes their eyeshadows can be a little chalky and not show up as nice as i want them to or as pigmented so one that's a thumbs up for me um this color that everyone is like raving about the like pukey baby brown whatever like everyone's like raving about in this palette does not really show up on me it's basically my skin tone I had no idea it was pukey baby brown color <laughs> but yeah it doesn't really show up on me um so i might i guess i could use it as like a transition color but it doesn't really like show up at, on me at whatsoever um another favorite of mine is obviously this green one this is the reason why i did buy it if you are going to be using this this color i would definitely just like use it on your finger or i guess with a synthetic brush because it doesn't like doesn't show up as nice i honestly like all like the shimmery colors are my favorites because i like i'm like a really glittery girl like i love that stuff you know you know i love that stuff she's right like i really do like the fact that she did say in one of her videos that it's nice to have like a black and a white oh my god I just realized that in my video I did not highlight my inner corner like the inner corner of my eye it's so annoying anyways um <laughs> so yeah like it is nice to have those type of shades in there because um you never know you might I always go like really glam like when I do my my makeup I always do like a smoky eye that's what I'm really comfortable with so having this black shade is really nice Although I can say it's not as dark as like um, as other black eyeshadows that I have. I have like the one from Too Faced in their Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar palette. As you guys know, it's like the palette that I always use. That black licorice in there is much darker than this one. But nonetheless, I think this palette is so amazing. I love how like light it is. So if you did want to take it like on the go, you can. Um, some people were complaining about not having a mirror. Mm, that's like something little like I don't really care about having a mirror I just mostly care if like the the shades show up you know and which they do oh my god guys I just messed up my freaking palette it's okay what up so far I have come up with two um, makeup looks so this is one that I put on my Instagram and the one that I'm basically wearing right now. I will be filming if you guys really want me to. I will film the other one as well. So leave comments below saying like you want to see how I create that eyeshadow look. But yeah, like I said, like I really love this palette. I think it's totally worth buying. Um, it's totally worth using her code so you're not paying a lot. Um, and just supporting her. I think like Kath Kathleen is such a sweet girl. Like, I mean, I've never met her. But I could just like, it's weird. When, we, when she does her videos, I sometimes feel like I'm in her room and we just like chilling and talking together and she, we doing our makeup and we just have a real conversation. But you know, obviously not. Obviously I'm just watching. I mostly bought it because I wanted to see if it was good for like dark skin girls. Um, and I totally think it, it is. Like this green, like I've, I've tried to do like green um, eye looks, but sometimes it just does not pick up as green sometimes it goes straight gray on me and as you guys can pretty much see like it's it's very vibrant like this green and in the inner on my like side I did use the the one that she said that is nice to pair up with which was this like um, olive green color right here it's really nice this one is like very creamy as well um, I think most of the colors are very like blendable so I think so far like this is a handy palette like if it could go from her fair skin to my dark skin this is a palette for everyone like I that's one thing I love about it I love her opinion I really feel like it's like honest and genuine and you know like Morphe so far like you got an A plus from me because 
yeah, this is my first time actually ever trying out a Morphe palette, Morphe eyeshadows. So I do plan on buying more of it. And um, I think the, the packaging is so cute and sleek. Like, very sleek. I'm sorry it's all dirty because I've been using it. But I think it's cute. Like, it's cute. I think that's it for this video. Like, I think you guys wouldn't go wrong if you decided to purchase it i honestly i have not checked to see if you guys can still purchase it i know one of my friends on instagram said she was trying to um purchase it but by the time she purchased like i think she waited like two three days and by the time she went to go purchase it it was all sold out so if it's still available i say you guys snap you guys should like really snap one before you know it's gone and um because i don't think they're going to like she has no idea she says this one is gonna be like once it's gone it's gone but that's how i feel like they always do that like you know what i mean like they always say oh it's that's it no more and then next thing you're like but it's back that's my opinion on it i think she did a good job thanks kathleen <laughs> yeah. thank you um and i guess that's about it guys so i hope you enjoyed this video i hope that like I gave you some type of good information on it. So yeah, guys, please remember to subscribe. Love you guys so much. And um, I'll see you in my next video. All right, bye. Mwah.